Hello guys, in today's video we've got two things to go over, thanks to this week's weekly reset there is a free bundle of bright dust which you can go and claim via the ever store which I will quickly go over and then we also have your guide for the second Riven's Wish quest. I'm going to jump into all the details as always in this video so if you're going to enjoy be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already as it's free to do and it really does help me out here a lot. Getting closer and closer to that 1000 sub goal and a lot of you who watch my content aren't actually subscribed so if you could do that I would super appreciate it. With that being said though, I hope you're going to enjoy this video and let's just jump straight into it. First off, let's talk about that free bundle of Bright Dust which you can obtain via the game right now. So if you load in and head over to the Eververse store, here on the homepage you'll notice that the Lunar New Year Celebration Bundle is available. And over here on the top right section of the weekly offerings, for me it shows the Year of the Dragon Bundle. But for you, if you haven't claimed it already, it should show a free bundle of Bright Dust for you to go and claim. I believe that in past yearly events where they do a chinese new year event this free bundle of bright dust normally persists over the next couple of weeks so be sure to log on each week and get your free bright dust with the free bundle of bright dust stuff now out of the way let's go ahead and jump into this week's riven's wish quest so just like last week you're going to head over to mara sov in the helm and she'll have the quest there waiting for you this one requires you to find seven ascendant chests within the dreaming city for this you will need a tincture of queen's foil which mara does give to you upon accepting the quest so you don't need to worry about that and if you find these chests quick enough you should only need to use one of them now in the gameplay you're going to be seeing all the locations of the seven chests that you'll be needing to complete this step i'm just going to play them all out here in order uh, so you can just speed up the video here now and then we'll talk once again after all chest locations have been shown
with all of those chests now found, you can once again return to Mara here in the helm. Approach her and she will give you your wish token for the week, which you can then spend once again on any last wish red border, any lightful exotic, or any sort of end game material that you want, be it a memento, ascendant shard, ascendant alloy, or exotic cipher. But that's it for this video, so I hope you guys found it helpful. If you did, remember to leave a like and subscribe, but that's it from me. So I'll catch you guys in the next one.